<laughs> she has the hard cut. Yeah. Hi, I'm Tony Fast daughter. I'm Tony Fast daughter. I'm Tony Fast daughter. Our family has been blessed to farm in Montana for over a hundred years now. And it wouldn't be possible without the great team we have and blessings from our Savior, Jesus Christ. Well, for those of you that haven't seen videos of this drill, this drill was new to us this spring. It is a 100 foot wide for gold 3420 model, 12 inch space. Um, it's got three quarter of an inch wide C tips with mid row banders uh, and V packers. Those of you that are familiar with the Rigo, now you know, so you're probably wondering. Uh, 1300 bushel grain cart or seed cart in the back. So it's individual tanks per compartment compared to the old ones that were all one well a tank. So this one has individual load cells for every tank. And that is awesome. I would not buy a primary drill without that after having it. Uh, the seed masters that we sold to buy this drill, we sold two seed masters and sold our uh, 450 quad and bought the air drill. So in the end, it really didn't cost us that much to go to one huge drill compared to the two well, we had an 80 and a 70 foot seat master. Not quite as productive with this one, but we're putting an air dryer system on the back of the cart that will put uh, hydraulic oil through a radiator that will suck the air through the radiator into the airstream for the air seater system. So all these little hoses will have heated, dried air next spring. That'll make this so we can run this thing 24 hours a day. Humidity won't bother us at all. That's the plan. We'll see how that all goes. In the cab, we got quite a bit going on here. 
We are running, uh, this iPad is Climate Field View. So we are watching all of our uh, seeding and fertilizer rates. We got put down 60 pounds of seed, 75 pounds of starter and urea. Two different fertilizer plants come and do two different spots. Uh, this is the Intelligent Egg Blockage Monitor. This is a fertilizer mid-row bander. So there's 50 sensors on the mid-rows. There's 100 on the seed. This iPad is the extend of this monitor, I should say. So this is the air drill control monitor. Uh, this has a ton of stuff going on in it. Got sections and, and fan speeds and tank. Uh, this is a switch box control, runs the sections, runs the drill on and off master switch. It's got a bunch of programmable stuff. Isolation switch, so when I'm having trouble pulling a hill, I can flip this. The mid row banders pop up. It takes a bunch of the engine load off so I can pull a hill. That's kind of the gist of it. Uh, we'll get out and fill here pretty soon. Oh, let's see. We'll go down and back to the middle here probably, see where we're at, go fill. I'll film a little bit of what's going on there. We got the iPad out here. Turn it on for scales. There we go. Put the remote out, the remote on, and shut the fans off. Grab the mic cord. Give it a little toss. Get it in the position I want it. Didn't throw it as hard as I normally do. And that's my mark to park the trucks. We'll let the air build up on those. We'll get the conveyor in position. Up and down's a little bit slow on this thing. I just put that screen back in there. Don't need it for the wheat, but the fertilizer has chunks in it. Just trust me, I'll show you. Tank four is my seed. Got 16,000. So we'll just say 16,700. Divided by 60 pounds per acre. We'll do 280 acres on that tank so I need to put in enough phosphorus combined with these two tanks at 75 pounds to equal 280. That's not supposed to be there. We'll we'll get a shovel and fix that in the morning. Well, time to clean up my mess. Morning. Look at that. 
much rather go kiss a buffalo in Yellowstone than pick a fight with him, though, that's for sure. Let's go finish seeding. Uh, 60 acres left and we'll have her done. That's a pretty successful uh, winter wheat seeding. Uh, put in about 16, 1700 acres, somewhere in there. So uh, it'll be nice to have that load off in the spring. Don't have to worry about coming all the way over here to seed this now, as long as it all uh, makes it. So the uh, only uh, real issue I had was uh, a few plugged hoses. I was playing around with the air speed on that on the seed fan and sometimes it got a little too low there and had to go clean out some hoses. So anyways, thanks for watching. Don't forget, farm hard, pray harder, and we'll see you next video. Oh yeah, building the shed. It's coming soon. Don't worry. Well, the time of the year we're not just gotta go home is here, unfortunately. He's going back to Argentina. He's going from farming all year here to farming all year back in Argentina. Yeah. Exactly. So, you're kind of excited though? Yeah, I am. Custom planting is going to start early November, so we got to be there for soybeans, early soybeans. We were talking yesterday about he's going to go back to this little equipment and it's going to feel really weird. Yeah. When he first got here, it was really weird to see all the big equipment. So Yeah, at some point you get used to see that huge tree, yeah. and the huge tractor and everything. So I'm still thinking on what's going to be that feeling of seeing small equipment around. But yeah. It's going to still take the same amount of time to finish a field. It's just the fields are bigger here to yeah, start with. <laughs> exactly. That's but, the biggest difference maybe. And rocks. Of and course. rocks, yeah. yeah. How many of those do you take home? Oh, none. None? No, hey, got girls, yeah. go get a rock for a nacho to take home. <laughs> just kidding. I got a giant one. It's like the standing <laughs> joke all harvest is you had to take rocks home. Yeah. We missed that earlier. So <laughs> thanks for coming. It was a lot of fun. And, uh, Hopefully someday we see you again. Yeah, I'll come back for visiting at least. Oh yeah, and the question of, is Nacho gonna do a YouTube back in Argentina? I don't think so. What? Yeah, I, I don't know. Probably an Instagram account, there you go. just in English, but yeah, I, I don't think that I'm gonna do a it's YouTube a lot, channel. It's a lot of work. Yeah, it is. So, go check him out on Instagram. We'll take him on things if you follow Fast Egg on Instagram. Yeah, thank so, you. Yeah. Thank you for that and for these last six months. It was yeah. a pretty cool experience. It's that quick already. Oh yeah. Or was that long? Doesn't seem like it was that long. Anyways. <laughs> it was, yeah. At some so point long. it was. It's so, it's so long, long for you, but the year went fast for us. So oh yeah. Long. You're ready to go home. Yeah. <laughs> it's hard to work with Tony Fast. No, it's not. <laughs> what were you saying? I actually married him. <laughs> she has a hard Cut! Job. Yeah. <laughs>